Our graduate program has uh, both an MA and an MS track. Um, we have students who come from various backgrounds. I always knew I didn't want to stay an accountant for my whole working career. So I spent some time really evaluating what it is I wanted to do with my life. And after a while, I realized that I really wanted to become a registered dietitian. I put two and two together when I was studying biology and realized that I could study the science of nutrition and become a registered dietitian. I chose to come to SU because of the research opportunities. We try uh, in our graduate research methods class to introduce them to faculty research interests in order to uh, collaborate with faculty on a current project. A number of students have done research looking at diet quality. Additionally, we have had some students who have an interest in integrative and functional nutrition within our department, so that's kind of our newest area of inquiry. We have our ACE Center, which is state-of-the-art equipment that we use to apply our knowledge within our classes. This is an awesome resource. The ACE Center wasn't here for me as an undergrad, and it brought a slew of opportunities just in the one semester, really, that it was open for me while I was here as a graduate student. I've had the opportunity to do physical assessments in the lab. We're applying all of our nutrition food knowledge and we're showing people how to make better behavioral choices. These are actual skills you can take with you into the real world. I've already applied these skills in job interviews. One thing that appealed to me about the Nutrition Science program was that it also does have a dietetic internship and it actually has a very high internship placement rate, especially among grad students, I believe it's in the upper 90 percentile, which is way above average for most schools. I've done study abroad before and it's been great giving me just a really different perspective about what I do here that I wouldn't get had I just stayed here. Students are able to do some coursework here, studying about the culture and about the diet and then they're able to go abroad to see the culture, do some actual hands-on cooking, and see and experience what they've learned in class right up front. We went to India for two weeks, and we were really studying not just the nutrition and culinary aspects, but getting a better understanding of all the different factors that contribute to their nutrition and dietary choices. So religion, family, social influences, different food systems. It'll help me look wider when I'm a future dietitian, so when I'm working with clients from unique backgrounds to help better understand their perspective of their dietary habits. SU really does a great job of teaching skills that can be used once students have graduated and moved on and really teach them to think critically and to emerge as leaders in their chosen areas. This is a field that is still up and coming and rich with opportunities. Our graduates have been really creative with, with what they want to do and can do with a nutrition degree. So students, once they graduate, often go on to either community or clinical types of positions. We have a nice employment rate once our students graduate. Some of our students who are not on that track have gone on to PhD programs. We have a few who've gone on to medical school. So a number of them use them in various ways to advance their knowledge in order to be able to move on in that direction. My advice to students in picking a master's program would be to really understand what your interest is in nutrition and to understand what is available to you. The nice thing about our master's program is that we have classes that touch on many different interests reach out and try to do all the opportunities you can. There are so many ways you can get involved, not just in your classes, but through outside research, working with clubs on campus, working with the dietetic associations, professional organizations. Being in a school that's dynamic and fluid and changing, I think is an important aspect. SU definitely has those qualities where they're looking at what's next, what's gonna be the new standards for practice. I think that's an important aspect to look for in a nutrition science program.